How's it going everybody? We are opening three blaster boxes of 2018 Bowman. Currently these go for about $32, $35 on eBay. They were going for a little bit more, but a redemption for Luis Robert is in here and it is currently expired. So if you pull one, maybe you can send it in, maybe Tops will work with you, but it's no guarantee. So I think they were selling a little higher, now they're a little lower. Um, but yeah, let's break into these. I'm hoping to get some Robert base. There's a Cunha prospect card, and of course, Shoya Tani rookies. So, still good cards. With a blaster, though, you're not guaranteed an autograph or anything, but still fun to look through. Especially with hobby box prices going insane now. Okay, Cooper, Clayton Kershaw. Ooh, nice Kyle Tucker. Blue refractor, number to 150 prospect card. So that's a pretty good card to start out with. Jordan Hicks, Bowman Chrome first. So not a terrible start for the first box. Pretty big fan of Kyle Tucker's. I know he hasn't really gotten any opportunities lately in the past couple seasons, but I think this year he's going to get a lot of opportunity. Um, Robbie Cano, Josh Bell for his breakout season, Dwight, Taylor Trammell, now a Padre. Um, Baez, not too bad, but it's paper. Some people don't like the paper, some people do. Um, Chrome is definitely preferable. You only get a couple Chrome cards out of each pack. So you really want your chrome cards to be good. This one's struggling. Verdugo, now with the Red Sox. Robles, World Series winner, caught the last out. Aaron Judge, nice star card, prospect of Nick Senzel. Scott Kingery, Nick Lauer. I really like that, uh, it's a Robles card, though. Pack. Got Tommy Pham, got traded to the Rays and now to San Diego. Stevenson, Stroman. Oh, so no guarantee of an auto, but we did pull one from Matt Beatty, who actually, he's played a little bit down the stretch last year for the Dodgers and did pretty well. So it's not a, um, a chrome auto or anything. It's a paper auto, which you can get out of the retail. His first Bowman, um... It's a sticker auto, not on card. Not a big fan of uh, sticker autos, but that's what you get out of retail. Um, yeah, I was not expecting to get an auto out of any of these boxes, and we hit one in the first. Let me uh, let me put this in a penny sleeve. So nice little first boom in Matt Beatty. Very cool. All right. So expectations have already been exceeded. Jojo Romero, Bobby Bradley, Chrome's, Nick Solak, I believe is for the Rangers now. It's kind of cool opening these old boxes because a couple years have gone by. There's no like, well, I shouldn't say there's no um, things out there where you're not sure how a guy's gonna do because you know there's Reese Hoskins though. You know he's good. Um, he, uh, people thought he was good back then. Now he hasn't really gotten an opportunity to play too much. Garcia, got a nice little AJ Puck. He should start whenever the season does start for the uh, Athletics this year. Soroka, no one really knew if he was going to be great. And last year he had a phenomenal season. So, when you're opening these 2018 Bowmans, even the Beatty. No one really, I don't think, was high on Beatty. Um... But now, knowing, seeing him play in the playoffs and stuff, I mean, he's he's a decent player. You never know. The Dodgers seem to be really good at finding those guys and getting the most out of them, like Max Muncy and Justin Turner. Okay, Crawford, Buxton, there's Bellinger, MVP last year, Arenado, 
Jordan Humphreys, Jorge Mateo. I feel like he's been around for five or six years now in every Bowman product. Another Jorge Mateo, as we say that. Okay. Winding down here on the first box. Okay. It's been a success so far. Felix Hernandez, Fowler, Jack Flaherty. He's a good rookie. Reese Hoskins again. Blake Rutherford. Rutherford, he was a huge prospect. I want to say in uh, 17, Chrome and Chrome. People were searching for his autos, and now you can get them pretty cheap on eBay. It's kind of flamed out since the Yankees traded him. Shope, Springer. Um, ooh, Jack Flaherty, rookie of the year, favorites rookie. It's weird with these rookies. We just got his paper rookie, and I feel like the inserts don't go for as much. Which, uh, you would think they'd be a little more rare, but... Alright, let's do this box next. I'd like to see a Devers rookie in here. He's another guy that just kind of... I don't know, he came up to the Major Jung, and... Oops. Hopefully I didn't jack any of those two up. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, so for our first box, that wasn't too bad. We got an auto, and we got the Kyle Tucker. I think there's usually one numbered card in each blaster box, and they get Kyle Tucker as a bad posy. There he is, Shohei Otani, rookie card. Let me uh, put this to the side for a second. Another Kyle Tucker Chrome. Emilius Ranhaus, Johnson, Josh Lau. Lau had a really good fall league, Arizona fall league, and a lot of people were really high on him. I remember years ago I bought his first Bowman Chrome rookie, or uh, not rookie, prospect auto. I think it was a purple refractor, pretty cheap, so. Be nice to see how his career progresses. Here's the show. I remember when this product first came out, everybody was going insane looking for the Super Fractor Auto for Shohei Atani. Some guy up in Northern California got it out of a hobby box. There's Walker Buell, rookie. Um, I think he got like $180,000 for it or something like that. So, Shed Long, he's turned into a pretty good player for the Mariners. But I remember, like, even just, I opened a couple hobby boxes, but running to Target trying to find these, these blaster boxes. Eric Fetty, Austin Hayes, he should actually have a good year once the season starts back up. I think the Orioles are pretty high on him. He was kind of a decent prospect that flated. Um, oh, Fernando Tatis Jr. prospect card. As big as he's exploded, these cards have actually done pretty good, I think. I'll put that one to the side. 